Hey guys, it's Animal Alpha here. Welcome to Let's Play Resident Evil 4 HD Remastered Edition. Resident Evil 4. I have a very long history with this game, but I'm going to shut up on the other thing. I'll never forget it. It was the year when those grisly murders occurred in the Arklay Mountains. Soon after, the news was out to the whole world, revealing that it was the fault of a secret viral experiment conducted by the international pharmaceutical enterprise, Umbrella. Boo! The virus broke out in a nearby mountain community, Raccoon City, and hit the peaceful little town with a devastating blow crippling its very foundation. Not taking any chances, the President of the United States ordered a contingency plan to sterilize Raccoon City. With the whole affair gone public, the United States government issued an indefinite suspension of business decree to Umbrella. Soon its stock prices crashed, and for all intents and purposes, Umbrella was finished. Six years have passed since that horrendous incident. I received special training via a secret organization working under the direct control of the president. I was to assume the responsibility of protecting the new president's family. Cornel, why am I the one who always gets me short in this stick? Yo, who are you really? Come on and tell us. You are a long way from home, cowboy. You have my sympathies. Guess that's a local's way of breaking the ice. Anyway, you know what this is all about. My assignment is to search for the president's missing daughter. What? All by yourself? <laughs> I'm sure you boys didn't just tag along so we could sing Kumbaya together at some Boy Scout bonfire. Then again, maybe you did. Oh, you crazy American. It's a direct order from the chief himself. I tell you, it's no picnic. I'm counting on you guys. It was right before I was to take on my duties of protecting the president's daughter when she was abducted. That's the ultimate reason I'm in this lonely and rural part of Europe. According to our intelligence, there's reliable information about a sighting of a girl that looks very similar to the president's daughter. Apparently she's being withheld by some unidentified group of people. Who would have thought that my first job would have been a rescue mission? Freezing. So cold all of a sudden. Eh, must be my imagination. Sorry it took so long. Just up ahead is the village. I'll go and have a look around. Yeah, we'll stay and watch that car. Don't want to get any parking tickets. Right. Parking tickets. Good luck. Jeez. Who are these guys? Did you say something? Leon, I hope you can hear me. I'm Ingrid Hunnigan. I'll be your support on this mission. Loud and clear. Somehow I thought you'd be a little older. So the subject's name's Ashley Graham, right? 
That's right. She's the daughter of the president. So try to behave yourself, okay? <laughs> Whoever this group is, they sure picked the wrong girl to kidnap. I'll try to find some more information on my end as well. Good. Talk to you later. Leon out. I have never been that quiet in all my two, three, two and a half years of Let's Playing. Anyway, guys, welcome to Resident Evil 4. I love this game so much. So. Shut up, Jigglypuff. Um, I have quite the history with this game. This is actually the first Resident Evil I ever bought with my own money. I ever beat. And on the GameCube, I beat it on the original version. You know, the one that everyone says is the absolute hardest. The one that pulled no punches and gave zero fucks whatsoever. I, I, I'm not going to say this is going to be a 100% let's play, but it's going to be close. Because in my mind, to truly 100%, I'd have to go through the entire base game twice. Uh, excuse me. Sir? Ominous music! I was wondering if you might recognize a girl in this photograph. ¿Qué carajo estás haciendo aquí? ¡Lárgate, cabrón! Sorry to have bothered you. Now, I don't speak Spanish, but I cannot imagine what he just told me was doing. Freeze! I said freeze! Get the hell out. Yeah. Damn. Not even five minutes in, and we're already got people swinging axes at us. Just don't want to ask me questions. That's not what's happening. That's not what's happening. Shit. <gasps> Is everything okay? There was a hostile local. I had no choice but to neutralize him. There are still others surrounding the area. Get out of there and head toward the village. Take whatever measures necessary to save the subject. Understood. I love how they don't even talk about Ashley like oh, she's a person. Uh, she's better than Mia. Anyway, like I said, welcome to Resident Evil 4. I know I've said that like three times already, but you know what? I have to say it. It's an amazing game. It is one of my favorite games. I have played through this game I don't know how many times. And we are playing on the PS4 version because you know what? I don't want anything else except for here. I kick you! Uh oh. That was not good. Move! Uh, he shows up in side mode. You can actually play as Wesker in this game. Yeah, but that's the only time you'll see him. Yeah. But he also shows up in separate ways. He's the one who gives Ada her mission. I hear a doggo. Alright, first, before we do anything, you see these boxes. Break the boxes. Boxes are made to be broken. Just like a lot of rules. And you see that one little bird. Get that bird, no matter what happens. You don't shoot any other bird in this entire game, that's okay. Get that one bird on the sign. I cannot stress this enough, guys. You get a free hand grenade. That is a free explosion. Simply from killing a bird. I guess you could say, Leon, shot the bird. <laughs> oh, bad puns. I love them. You all hate them, but I love them. So you know what? Red Herb. That's mine. Oh, yeah. By the way, save the dog. Hi. I am not close enough. Now I am. Whoa! That dude just tanked a knife to the face. And Leon's jacket flaps in the wind. 
Flappy Jacket. New game, I'm coining it. You've heard of Flappy Bird, now it's time for Flappy Jackets. Ah, uh, they'll figure it out. You gonna throw something? Oh, you ducked! I had perfect accuracy until this point. You a hole. Resident Evil 4. This game changed the way Resident Evil was made. It turned it from a survival horror game to survival action. By the way, those three guys. Yeah, don't get used to seeing those three. It's the only time you're ever gonna see them. They do not show up in New Game Plus. Uh, Canon Lee, those three are supposed to supposedly go warn the villagers about your presence. By the way, this is a dick move. Just right in here, this is a very dickish move. You walk in, you expect them to get three items. There, then there's this asshole who has an axe. He's just waiting for you to walk in there, because you're not expecting him. Okay. Now. I keep forgetting Triangle brings up the inventory, or the map, not the inventory. I want the inventory, because I'm going to show you guys probably the stupidest thing you could do if this is your first time playing. I do not recommend doing this. Leon, how you holding up? Bad question, Hanukkah. Sorry to hear that. Yeah, this I'm is... Sending you a play don't do what I'm doing. Find it useful. I'll take a look at it. Yeah, Thanks. this is how you don't play this game on New Game. Wait until... By the way, that was a playing manual. It's just tutorial. I can explain everything that says that thing says, but I'm not going to. Actually, I might. That might actually be helpful to you know being a let's play and a walkthrough. Okay, we're gonna sneak by this one. We're gonna get some extra cash. Just real fast. See that guy up there? Throw the grenade at that guy. Then get your handgun out and pray because. This is a chainsaw dude. He is not a friendly man. He is very unfriendly. I'm pretty sure he wants to kill Leon. But I don't know why because Leon's awesome. Oh god! Oh, oh god. Oh god. That would have been... No, that is not good enough for my first death in this game. Yeah. This is how not to play Resident Evil 4, people. Like I said, I do not recommend doing that if this is your first time ever playing this game. You don't cuss a lot. Why are these people? You just let me alone. What are they planning? Son of Leon, you have a potty mouth, sir. Yes, I do, but that's not my potty mouth is not in question. It's Leon's potty mouth. Right. What we are gonna do is we have just effectively exploited one of the biggest glitches, or one of the more well-known glitches in this game, the double chainsaw man glitch, double Doctor Salvador's. This is not recommended for new players. I am throwing that one out there right now. If this is your first time playing, do not do this. I'm doing it simply because I need the extra money for what, all the stuff I plan on doing in this game. Come on, boy. Damn! Okay, I need to kill him before I kill all, all these other people. He has got to die or else I do not get what I wanted to do with this glitch. Uh, is he dead? He is dead. Good, 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 good. He is dead. That's all I want is him dead. Now we will run around like a moron trying to survive this it got me a thousand extra dollars to use on upgrades hmm. 
we do not see him until chapter two. Or chapter one dash two. Oh, axe out of nowhere. These people do not like Leon. And I am performing absolutely horribly. Oh god, let's players! Every other person who's ever attempted to make a video on YouTube and play a video game know exactly what I'm talking about. You can be as good as you want to be at this game the minute you press record. The minute you press that record button. You suck worse than anything. Yeah. Yeah, because you're wanting to be good on the game for all the people watching you. Of course, I don't even know. Don't you throw that! Don't you throw that! Oh shit, he threw it. Okay, I'm hurting. Go ahead and use this. She can't throw that. You're not getting up. Oh shit. How'd you get here? Come on, guys! Headshot! Well, out of shotgun shells. Oh, I am sucking, guys. I don't remember this part being this bad. Don't do as I do. Oh, full ammo. Okay, good. Oh, that's not it. Oh, I kicked your head off. <laughs> Woo! Oh, God. everyone going bingo Honigan, I have some bad news I've confirmed the body of an officer something's happened to the people here Leon you need to get yeah they're called there. zombies Leon Look for a tower and follow the trail near it got it Well, like I said, told you before, Jigglypuff, the guy who made The Evil Within was involved with the making of this game. A lot of people considered The Evil Within to be the true, the true uh, sequel to Resident Evil 4. Yeah, it was a, it was a spiritual successor to uh, Resident Evil. I want to go. Take me. Anyway, we survived that by the skin of our teeth. Because if that last guy would have grabbed me, I'm pretty sure Leon wouldn't be talk standing here. And that would have been more embarrassing of a death than ch death by chainsaw, dude. Okay. Yellow. R yellow herbs. Most important herb of everything. It will fill your health bar more than what it's supposed to. It will actually increase your maximum health. Combine it with a red and a green, and you will get a full heal plus more health. Very important. Very important. When you were trying to play it, I was passed out. I enjoy what. I also enjoy watching you suffer. <laughs> Yeah, Jigglypuff has a so somewhat funny story to tell about this game. She, after me pleading with her for right at 11 years now for her to give this game a shot, she finally tries it. She stood there for two hours trying to figure out how to make Leon run. 
She tried everything except for the one thing that actually makes Leon run. She didn't hold down the X button. Okay, we're gonna reload everything we have. Uh, word of advice. Oh, no, I'm not gonna say that yet. No spoilers! Even though I'm pretty sure anyone watching this has played this game before. <laughs> because this game is just that well known. Honestly, I cannot sing enough praise about this game. I love everything from the soundtrack to the boss fights. The logo is very scary. And we're gonna go ahead and use that because I don't like Leon. I don't. I like my Leon no limp, no limp Leon. In fact, that's the title of this episode's name: No Limp Leon, yeah. or Limp Be Gone. All right, guys. Well, we started this game. We made it through the village with only a few minor heart attacks. You know, we didn't run out of ammo completely. We almost did. But, I think I'm going to call this episode here, after I grab this. Alert order. Recently, there has been information that a United States government agent is here investigating the village. Do not let this American agent get in contact with the prisoner. For those of you not informed... Oh, thank you, I am not informed. The prisoner is being held in the whole house beyond the farm. Well, that's convenient. We will transfer the prisoner to a more secure location in the valley when we are ready. The prisoner is to stay there until further notice. Meanwhile, do not let the American agent near the prisoner. They're really stressing that. Do not let Leon near the prisoner. Got it. We do not know how the American government found out about our village, but we are investigating. Spy! However, I feel like this intrusion at this particular time is not a coincidence. I sense a third party other than the United States government involved here. My fellow men, stay alert. Chief Vitores Menendez. I probably just butchered that name, but okay. Anyway, guys, we're going to end off here for now. I'll see you guys in the next part.